Hey folks, and welcome to this week's news and community spotlight. The State of Unreal returns to GDC. Tune in live on March 22nd at 9.30 a.m. Pacific to hear the latest updates in game development from Epic Games. For the full Unreal GDC agenda, head to unrealengine.com GDC 2023. Are you new to real-time animation or ready to sharpen your skills? We've unveiled fresh control rig samples, including four varieties that are fully rigged and ready to animate in Sequencer. Find out more about the samples, along with links to a collection of our favorite related developer resources at unrealengine.com feed. Take a journey back to the Wild West with our Old West Learning Project. Right off into the sunset with seven free 3D asset packs, including almost 400 meshes, alongside a beginner-based tutorial and a deep dive live stream with insight on how to use them. Last week, we celebrated VR Games Week. In addition to interviews with the teams behind Don't Blink, The Walking Dead Saints and Sinners, and Another Fisherman's Tale, we caught up with Guerrilla Games to discuss the development behind the impressively large-scale Horizon Call of the Mountain. Discover how the team summited the challenges they faced and how PlayStation's next-gen VR hardware made it possible. Developer First Contact Entertainment also shared how it leveled up its squad-based shooter with Firewall Ultra by leveraging UE5's expansive features and next-gen tech for the PlayStation VR 2 with eye-tracking, enhanced haptics, and real-time lighting. Pivoting from VR to conservation, in order to preserve the legacy of CC, 19th century Empress of Austria and Queen of Hungary, Digital Art Service Arsenal has recreated sections of the Empress's private collection, along with her palace chambers in Vienna, in breathtaking detail with the help of Reality Capture and Unreal Engine. Mosey around this digital museum on the feed. Now for this week's Community Spotlights, Introducing the vast social sandbox MMO inspired by the legends of the medieval era. In Pax Day by Mainframe Industries, myths are real, ghosts exist, and magic is unquestioned. The land is ready to host your home, reputation, and stories. The question is, what world will you make? Wishlist Pax Day on Steam. Environment and prop artist Rashab Nanda's latest narrative creation is no miniature feat. In an intense three-week world-building fellowship, they conceived this beautiful museum environment. Focusing on miniatures led them to experiment with landscape and foliage tools, harnessing the powers of UE5, Quixel, and Sketchfab's vast content libraries. Look through the glass of this project on their ArtStation page. Bounding over to our last spotlight, Leap is a fast-paced, multiplayer, first-person shooter featuring epic battles with up to 60 players, now available on consoles. Become an elite Leap mercenary for either the United Earth Defense Coalition or the Rebel Exoterrans as you soar into battle, or create your own experiences with a heavy modding component on console versions. Leap from Blue Isle Studios is available right now on Steam. Thanks for watching this week's news and community spotlight.